What if you didn't need a lot of hot air? What if you didn't have to use expensive and rare helium? What if you didn't have to use dangerous hydrogen? What if you could create buoyancy in a completely new way? Buoyancy with vacuum. Traditional airships and balloons generate their buoyancy with lifting gases. One cubic meter of air weighs about 1000 grams. Heated air weighs a little less. One cubic meter of helium weighs only 180 grams. Hydrogen is twice as light as helium. One cubic meter of vacuum weighs nothing. Nothing. What if you built an airtight buoyancy body that could withstand a vacuum, while being extremely light? What happens when the air is extracted from this hollow sphere with a vacuum pump? Will the sphere take off? It won't work that way. The structure of a C60 carbon molecule, also known as a fullerene or buckyball, is considered to be one of the most stable structures in science. A frame made of ultralight and stable material in the form of a fullerene could withstand the forces of a vacuum. An ultralight, airtight and tear-resistant film is stretched over this frame. Again, the air contained in this buoyancy body is extracted with a vacuum pump. Will the buoyancy body withstand the vacuum this time? The buoyancy body takes off as soon as the weight of the extracted air and body is lower than the buoyancy force. What if several such buoyancy bodies are combined? The airship could rise and land on its own, if the vacuum pump is installed directly in the airship. And what happens when you think big? Big! Is a city in the clouds possible? Or a rocket launch and landing platform? Who can answer this question? What is your opinion on this subject? Do you think that's possible or is it all nonsense? Please write it in the comments. Thank you for watching.